Hey guys, what's up? So I'm going to do a quick, um, like romantic situation. Um, this is water for water signs. Um, I'm going to be doing cancer. So it's asking you to make the effort in this relationship. There could have been lack of effort, um, and which caused separation. Um, but there needed to be separation in order to like appreciate each other more and realize that the great love is worth taking, um, steps to be guided into keeping an open mind your soulmate may differ from the usual type that you have expectations for that you're used to it could even do with age looks anything this could be um restricting or uh, having an effect with your love life with religious um factors you might be up you might have been brought up with different kinds of religions um there has to be for some forgiving in this relationship uh as you do heal the past yeah, you'll experience more love in the present moment for this person and the others. And it will give you a learning lesson to understand grief and understand even trust. Yep. Okay. So this situation is calling for you to have more trust. So things can um, move to a higher level of commitment or re relationship in general. You guys might not even be together. Um, and you'll be able to enjoy um, each other's company. Uh, this is talking about, like, enjoying the bliss of a holiday together. So we do have Halloween coming up. Um, they could be expressing their love or some expression. Expression of love from some side could be around Halloween or during October or maybe even the beginning of November or um, Thanksgiving. They might want you to come over for Thanksgiving and meet their family. You do deserve love. Um, retreating right now and really focusing on yourself and disconnecting from the world is really um, recommended at this time, which has to do with the separation. Like there's a reason why there was a separation because there was retreating that needs needed to be understood because there was too much codependency. Um, there could have been addictions um, rather than just a codependent on each other. Um, and, but it's definitely affecting your romantic life somebody could be drinking or doing drugs and it's like numbing them from their feelings so they're not able to feel this connection very well but it is asking you to retreat at this time because you might not be feeling worthy of yourself and the codependency of this other person and what they think and what they want is uh kind of hurting your self-esteem can i have four more for cancer please Spirit, please. Thank you. Give your relationship a chance. When things do come together and some family issues are healed, uh, you might have a mother wound or a father wound, but it's saying that your love life will benefit as you do forgive your parents, which has to do a lot of forgiving and learning as well, to so being able to live in the present moment I and mean, love in the present moment because once you release and heal your past, your childhood traumas, you're able to love yourself more and um, give, you know, partnerships and relationships uh, with people, regardless of romantic friends, co-workers, um, you know, acquaintances. It helps you with giving them a chance to be a part of your life. Um, but it's asking you to work on your partnership at this time. But when it says that, I feel like it's asking you to work on yourself. This could have something to do with children. You guys could have children together or... Um, you guys could have children with other people and you're very loyal to your children so they might not like the other person or the, they might have you might be worrying about how it's going to all play out with having a, your own child with this other person or the person's going to be good for your kid to be around yeah it's asking you just to like start getting to know each other um, this could have to do with a wedding. Again, you guys could be taking things to the next like, next level and getting to know each other more. Um, as you reveal most of your innermost um, selves to each other and be your authentic self, it's going to help your bond deepen. But again, that self-worth and self-esteem needs to come from you first. You are protected in this situation. Um, and there is a lot of resilience on both sides of trying to work this relationship out. Um, whether you see it or not, it could be behind the scenes. Um, somebody could have put up boundaries for the time being in order to be able to have mm, this relationship create, be created in more of a, <laughs> in more of a, um, 
healthy relationship. Yeah, because right now there's a void. There's a pause of stagnancy because there needs to be more self-love. Right. 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 And there's sh the energies are going to start shifting in the next couple of days. Um, you're really going to be coming into more of your goddess energy, which is going to bring you a lot of peace of mind. Um, that's been... Um, your peace of mind, um, you're going to be purifying your thoughts more and you're um, disciplining your um, behaviors and uh, negative patterns and cycles. And that's what's been holding back this relationship is stuff like that. Um, the universe is like trying to tell you like, you know, this is what's been res resisting, like resist your resistance is to self-loving yourself. Um, there's assessing um, that needs to be done right now within yourself again doing the inner work of self-love finding your worth your self-esteem hey stop it yeah it's asking you to surrender to the divine what was i saying i was saying something to oh, i don't remember it was good too oh the divine knows that right that when you guys met it wasn't the time for you guys to like yeah, it's asking you to release all expectations of the outcome and stop trying to force change um, out of fear and let it blossom on its own into new beginnings. Um, but the divine knew that you guys weren't ready, so they had to separate you to be able to help you come together in a more healthier way where it's going to last in a long-term relationship that could have to do with a wedding um, a higher level of commitment in order for you guys to have came together. So this is necessary. Self-love, finding your self-love is very necessary at this time because that's what's really resisting everything to come together into union. So I made these cards. It's just like a little something like what your person would say to you right now um, if or their higher self would say to you. Um, if you're not in communication, then... Okay. They'll never stop loving you no matter what. They are feeling a little jealous right now. You did stand out from everybody, um, which is why they actually are trying to do the inner work and change. You don't know the real them. Um, and the reason why they say that is because you're being restricted to access of them, um, of contact, because this needs to be done first. So you don't know their real authentic self because things have been hidden. Um, the feeling of jealousy could be because you're going out with your friends more and they're seeing social media or something like that. And um, they're getting jealous of like not being able to be with you, getting jealous of the people that are allowed to be with you right now because they feel like they need to see your beautiful face and the silence between you two or the um, lack of communication is really saying something right now. It's really speaking to them. Um, they could be realizing your worth and how much you really do mean to them and how much they miss you and how they can't like... Um, be without you they are paying for whatever it is they did to hurt you um they do have a surprise for you when they do come in they can't do this anymore they really they've been dreaming of you lately they're ready to explore this on a deeper level um but they want to be their complete and authentic self with you so they are healing right now to find their self-love in order to be able to do that and trust themselves and you to be able to not hurt them okay Thank you, Cancers. I hope this helped in some type of way. I will see you later. Mwah. Love you guys. Bye.